Welcome back design students. So for this step we need to be in Photoshop. So find Photoshop and open it up. And then let's click open. And then we need to find that template that we made. Should be in your Scene Assets Images folder. And it should be called Bottle UEW. Find it and open it up. And it should look like this. And then you need to find and open up a picture of a wine bottle label. Um, I have a couple. I have this one that has three different labels on it. And the advantage of doing it this way instead of just creating a piece of geometry uh, that we would stick on the bottle is that we can create different shapes. So I'm going to use um, this one since it's kind of fancy. I'm going to zoom in some. You can do that by holding down Alt and rolling your mouse wheel. And then we need to select the label. So to do that, I'm going to use the Quick Select tool, which is this tool, and it kind of goes up like a brush. Then I'm just going to select, kind of brush around the edges of my label. And hopefully we won't go outside anything. Now because there's a nice contrasting background here of white, we can do this very easily. So now we need to hit Control C to copy this selection that we've created. Go back to the UV template and hit Control V to paste it in. And now all we need to do is place it where we want it to be. I think maybe it should go off to one side here. Actually, you know, it doesn't matter. I'm going to put it right smack in the middle. And you can see here that I have some uh, little artifacts here. Just a little bit of white uh, here and here. So I'm going to uh, erase those. I'm going to get my eraser tool. Make sure I have that layer selected. And I'm just going to very lightly just sort of brush right up against it so I can erase those little bits. And I'm going to do the same thing right here. You don't have to do this if you don't have any little artifacts. Take a look at other parts of it while we're zoomed in. I think that looks pretty good. So I'm going to zoom back out. Okay, now we need to render this out. So what we need to do is turn off the UV template. And this is what we want. Just a label on a blank, transparent background. Now... We're going to export this as a PNG, and that's very important because PNGs will have a transparent background, and that's what we want. The transparent background is called an alpha channel. So let's go to File, Export, As, and that brings up this little window. And then you need to make sure it says PNG, and you need to make sure that transparency is checked. And then click Export, and then go to the correct location. That is in your Scene Assets Images folder of your project folder in 3D Max. And I'm going to name this label and click Save. And that is all we need to do for now. In the next video, we'll create a material and apply it to our wine bottle. And I'll see you then.